it was brilliant, yeah. You know, first hit out to get a win's good. Obviously, we've had a long layoff, so to come back with a win's brilliant for the squad, you know. Now, hopefully, we can build on that next week. And on, and on a personal, personal level? level? Yeah. Mate, can't wait. Happy, so happy. You know, good that uh, he got the, got the 80 in the bag, but, you know, that's home. And I'm back home, so I'm very happy. Well, you say you've got the 80 in the bag. You're still looking pretty fresh. Don't look too fresh, or they'll have you, uh, they'll have you going. I don't know, doing some sprints or something. Um, it seemed like a massive team effort this evening. Everyone knows about Sail Sharks. We know what they bring, but you really fronted up today. Um, but this back three with you guys is super exciting. What does it feel like to be a part of that unit and to the potential that you've got? Really, what do you think you can inflict on this league? You know, I think. Um, it just speaks for itself. You've got Brownie, he's the most capped fullback mm. ever for England, and then Ashy's one of the most prolific try scorers in Prem history. So, um, you know, we've got two brilliant guys um, alongside myself, and, you know, I'm just trying to learn from them, get better, and then, you know, hopefully we can just. Take the, take the lead by storm and just keep doing what we're doing. Keep scoring tries. Well, we hope so. I mean, this is Harlequins Live. We've got the fans watching at home. We can't wait to bring them back to the stoop. Um, have you got a message for the fans watching? No, just stay patient, you know. I know the guys are doing everything they can to, to get fans back. And we can't wait to have you when you are. Well, come on the Quint. Hey, well played Quint. today. Cheers. And uh, good luck against Saris next time out. We will leave you. I say get it. What, what happens now? Do you get a shower and go or is it straight yeah, in the car? We're allowed to shower. We're allowed to shower. So oh, right. at well, least we can enjoy that ourselves. and enjoy the victory. You. Uh, you are heading out. Is Joe Marchant coming in? Bring him in. Bring him in. Uh, welcome back. Huge win. Congratulations. Um, in your words, how was it? Oh, it was it was tough. Uh, they came hard. We knew they would, but yeah, it's just it was good to get out of there. It was good to get a little first little hit out and a good win uh, at Stoops. It's just shame, shame obviously the fans can't be here, but like, yeah, it was amazing, amazing day. Um, a lot of media attention around you and Manu today. That 13 spot, obviously, you've got ambitions to to wear that jersey for for England as well. Uh, what were your thoughts on sort of your performance against him and, and how he played it, and just the general build up around it all, really? Um, yeah, just obviously, you know, um, coming up against such a world-class player you've you've got to really keep um keep your mind on like on yourself and keep doing your own thing um and yeah like so you just don't just want to keep him out of the game as much as possible try and take his space away and it was a tough one he, he runs so hard and you just gotta you just gotta keep getting him down so yeah, it was good though we all the boys bought in as well and, and we got some gains from it how is it with no fans oh it was strange it was um yeah, it felt a bit weird warming up and stuff uh, with, with no crowd, but yeah, we're just looking forward to hopefully if, if we can get a crowd soon, because obviously we get such a, a buzz off it, um, of, especially off the Quinns fans, so hopefully soon. Great performance today. Congratulations. Uh, good luck against Saris. Thanks very much. Cheers.